African football's big day. 14 nations started out stating their case to be the best on this continent. 12 have fallen short, and now it is down to this. So much pride, so much drive at both national and personal levels. Nerves, expectations, this is the one that everyone wants to win. Oh, what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Both teams, Jim, eyeing the ultimate prize here, unerring focus and determination in all of those eyes. Yes, Peter, I've been a, a winning finalist and I've been a, a losing finalist and I don't need to tell anyone what I prefer. Winning will help fans remember you for a long, long time. So I sincerely wish both teams well and hope that all the players can give a good account of themselves and, and you've heard it before, may the best team do it. And already we're underway here. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Forward it goes. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Nice lifting it over. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. And the through ball is intercepted. Out to the right. Hakimi throws it in. Piate gets it back. Uh, needed a better pass there. That's the through ball. Face to face with the keep. Has a hit! And he's there to clear it. Gay. Battles to win it back. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Aimed into... Heads in! are certainly a team that knows how to play their football as stylishly as you'll see. Tiki Taka at its very best and they back it up with goals. Senegal have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Tries to get it forward quickly. And that's too far for anyone.
and it's Zayek. Morocco have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Hoists it forward. Zayek. Plays it out to the flank. Hakimi provides an outlet. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. Plays it over to the other flank. He's got through. That's found its target. Hakimi. He's pinged one through here. And he's cut it out. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had... Good options around him, and he failed to get his head up. Hakimi is on to it and can take it up. Oh, that's neat. A chance to play it in. Turns and goes back. Pumps it into the... Gets up to head it! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. And it's played forward. Played out to the right. Half an hour played now. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. And Senegal can counter. Kiate goes looking out towards the flank. Mane, real chance! <laughs> Morocco going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Koulibaly. Senegal uh, looking odds on to go in at the break with their advantage intact. Back to the keeper and try something new. Oh, that had to be more accurate. In. Played out to the right. Back in once more. And it's hoisted clear. Can he deliver? Meets it first time! We've got a goal! Well, we're all back to square one, but I hope this game opens up from here. It looks as if it will happen. Oh, that always looked the likely outcome. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off.
has certainly made things interesting. Well, if anyone in this stadium thinks they haven't got value for money, I give up. Idris again. Koulibaly to play it forward. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? I think both teams have played their part in what's been a, a pretty tight affair. And this is exactly the type of match now when the better players can come to the fore and make all the difference. And that's a really interesting game. And they head in at half time at 1 1. Already up and running for the second half. Changes made by neither side, from what we understand. Idris Sakei. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Looking for a corner. with the clearance. Zayek. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Zayek. Plays it out to the wing, cuts it out. Played into space out wide. Keeps everyone guessing. So who's he picking out? He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Hoists it forward. Dinks one in. Mane passes it out wide and in space. Oh, that is lovely footwork. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. And here's Mane. Mane goes for the cross. Senegal making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front. And this is something different. Yate. Forward it goes. Just brushed off the ball there. He's got away. Lovely bit of skill. And it's got through. Tries his luck. It's gone a long way up and away. Buffal. That is terrific skill. Plenty waiting in the middle. Oh, real chance. He's had a shot. Decent enough try. Good effort. Very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Tries to stroke it through. What an adventurous run from a defender. Out for a throw.
good feet. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. He's made sure that that won't get through. And they can counter here. Just brushed off the ball there. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. It's a throw. Morocco have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. <laughs> Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Good ball. Oh, good ball. And the flag has stayed down. Time to deliver. And here's Zucker goes for goal! That has certainly tested the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Helps available out wide. Tries to get it clear. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Hakimi desperately wants to get on the end of this. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. He's got options out wide. And here's Zuck, hits one! And the ball's come out. Morocco have it back and they can go again. Buffal. Lovely feet. There are a few waiting for it. So not long left in this now. It does seem we're headed for extra time here, unless, of course, there is one last dramatic twist. Tries to get it full. Goes for goal! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Changes here from both sides, in fact. So we have a double substitution going on here. And it is a corner again. We've played it short. Played into the middle. Cleared away. It's come through, gets on the end of it, and here's Zayek, tries a shot! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Oh, 
ball's gone out of play. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Hoists it forward. Morocco desperately need a goal, and this could well be their last chance. That's a pop! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper, has just received an A-plus grade. After 90 minutes, there will be extra time. Yeah, this has been a hard-fought game, Peter. There's been a healthy dose of drive and ambition, and sometimes that isn't rewarded with goals just like this one. I've seen a lot worse, though. So all square, we need a winner, and we will be back for extra time. And if you're just back, well, the action is back underway already. And it's Mane. Kuyate. Mondi. Battles to win it back. Hakimi. Morocco thwarted in the end. That move lacked any sort of thrust. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Kuyate. Over to the left. Played back in. Shoots! <laughs> That's not going to make it. Zayek. Forward it goes. Going through. And the shot! Oh, it's in! And that has raised the roof! The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. Senegal go into the lead. Hakimi gets it back. And it's played forward. Tries to switch the play. Hakimi is fouled.
chance to get it forward quickly. And that's it for the first half of extra time. Well, there's plenty of potential for a final twist in this test. I think there's bound to be some late drama in the final 15 minutes of this epic. Well, we are already up and running again. So, time for a bit of smash and grab. Done very well to intervene. Hoists it forward. Oh, and he's asking too much with that. Battles to win it back. Hoists it high. And it's Zayek. That was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Now it's Mane. Mane with a shot! He should have put that one away. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he'd be desperate to get another. And it's played forward. That's a decent ball. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, that's a foul, free kick's been given. Senegal just have to run down the clock. Balotore, Mane. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Senegal probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. Keeper sends it forward. Out to the left it goes. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. And that is that. Senegal reign in Africa. The culmination of a fabulous tournament. They are fabulous and deserving winners. So on to centre stage come the central characters, the individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment.